What's up? B Rax back on Brax Talks. Oh man. About the Texans, man. Holy crap. Like, you know what? I don't think our coach is serious about winning. You know what? If our coach was serious about winning, he would go sign Colin Kaepernick or RG3 or the management would. So, and you know what? It's, you know we're not going to win a game with Tom Savage the rest of the year. Rest of the year. So, you know, I don't think our coach should be there next year because obviously winning is not important to him. And that's sad because I'm a diehard Texans fan. And I know we're not going to win with Tom Savage. Deshaun Watson's our answer, but, you know, we got to have a backup to him. Maybe draft Omar Jackson or something as a backup. That's crazy to say, but we're going to have to do something because you got to have a backup just as good as Deshaun Watson. Anyways, I couldn't decide what to eat, so I was driving around town for a little bit, and I was like, you know what? I was going to go to Fat Joe from El Taco Taco, and I was like, you know what? I've had enough El Taco Taco videos, and you can't, y'all people can't get El Taco Taco where you are. So, I just went to Taco Bell again, and I went and got a, got some napkins, and I went and got a, some quesadillas, steak, no jalapeno sauce, and I just, this bad boy, Oh, y'all can't see it. Uh, the Power Bowl. We got the Power Bowl. The State Power Bowl. Let me take this lid off. Because the State Power Bowl is like the best thing they have. If y'all never had it, I'm sorry. But y'all need to try it. Here it is. It's good. It's only 500 calories. So, yeah. And let's see. We got some, got some uh, steak. Got some black beans. Got some cheese. Got some sour cream. Got some lettuce, and I think under all this there's rice. And on the lettuce, they put this avocado ranch dressing. But what I like to do is, man, I like to mix all this up. So, yeah, you can kind of see the rice now on the bottom. It's all this up, and it's like eating a salad. It's really good. You see the beans now. It's all this up, man. This is like my favorite thing. Mix all the sour cream up in there. Oh, yeah. Oh, fall it out. And when I was like on the board, the uh you know the menu board at Taco Bell, the guy was like, Is everything look correct on the screen? I was like, Oh yeah. And so I looked at it. Then that dude took my sour cream off. No, bro, no, you don't do that. You take the guacamole off, like I said, because I can't stand that. So I got no uh guacamole or pico de gallo. Cause I don't like pico de gallo. Because I don't like raw onions and I don't like tomatoes. And I don't like guacamole. I like avocado slices though on things. But guacamole, it just does not taste good to me. It's a horrible taste. I, yeah, anyways. Mm. Now, it's all mixed up. Got some steak, got some rice. Mm. And I love this thing. I've had a few times. Lettuce. Mm. And when I eat this, I feel good. It's feel good food. <laughs> you know, man, because if I eat fried stuff all the time, I don't feel good. It's not feel good food. Oh, yeah. Mmm. -hmm. So it's like everything you have in a burrito, basically, just in a bowl. And, oh my god! 10 second rule wasn't on the ground long enough. I went and got a blue raspberry freeze. Oh, that's pretty good. No, it's not. The airhead blue raspberry freeze. You know what that tastes like? It's okay, I'll never get it again. This tastes like... It tastes like a... A fizzy slush, like a, like a soda slush. I don't know about that.
Oh yeah, I just got cheese, but I'm feeling pretty strong on the cheese today. Mmm. Hands down, best thing Taco Bell has. And that's saying something, because Taco Bell has a lot of good things. There's some steak with that big piece of steak. Like I said, there's only 500 calories in this thing. But if you haven't seen my video yet, uh, yesterday, where I went to Taco Bell, and I uh, tried to get the Nachi Bell Grande, where they had a... Uh, uh, where it said shredded beef, and they gave me regular beef. I was so disappointed. I didn't finish them because it wasn't what I wanted. See, you can see the beans, the lettuce, a little bit of cheese hanging there, rice, meat. I don't know if you see meat in there. But it's all mixed together, and it makes this a magical taste creation. There's some meat, or steak. You know, I always get steak at Taco Bell. I haven't had this in too long. I mean, I know it's been a while. I love this thing. Mm. Beans, I don't know about y'all. Beans, beans are good for your heart. Beans, beans are make you fart. And also, they make me feel good. You ever read something where you just feel good? That's what beans do. That's what beans do for me. The only thing I wish they changed about this. Don't put cheese on here. This doesn't need cheese. It's good enough without it. You know what that tastes like? No, I'm not gonna say it. But oh look at it! It starts going down the straw. There it goes. <laughs> there it goes. See right there. There it goes. Anyway. As soon as like I started drinking that, you could just smell the raspberry. I can smell it. Well, um, yeah. It's like a, like I said, it's like a sausage sonic. But it tastes like it has soda in it. Almost done with this. Mm. I don't like this thing. This thing was gold. But I don't like the peak of the guy on this because he gets all over everything. I can't stand that. Good down to the last drop. That was a steak power bowl. Oh, it's a rice. Now for the quesadillas, my friend. Oh, come on, close, my friend. There you go, Taco Bell. All right, now for quesadillas. Oh, man, let's just see what that did to my table right there. Look, made it all steamy where I had it. Right there. All right, quesadilla time. Now, I get steak quesadillas, of course. I don't like their chicken. You know, their chicken steak at Taco Bell. Should have got two orders of these. 
Anyways, here we go. I got these with no uh, quesadilla sauce. Mm. Well, you know, the jalapeno sauce, and I don't like that. These aren't too good. Do y'all remember, uh, maybe last year, like two years ago, when Taco Bell had those, uh, flatbreads? Those steak and chicken flatbreads? Those were terrible. It's, it's kind of like this. I don't like how the meat's all, like, juicy, man. I'm not on this. It needs to be drier than this. See it? They need to do it like how Taco Taco does it. How the steak is kind of dry. Even though I like, I like juicy steak, yeah. But not in something like this. Because it makes everything else, it ruins it. It could soggy. I don't know if people can say these are the best things to talk about, because they're surely not. Talk about those. Oh, no. No. It's fake Mexican food, what it is. But the Power Bowl is actually good for you. These are alright. I do them every once in a while. That tastes so awkward. Like, if, if you're gonna get something like that, just go, just go to Sonic. And get you a frozen cherry lemonade. It's ten times better than that, and it tastes better. And it's Sonic. Oh, a piece of cheese. Hold up, I gotta ask y'all something. Like, I was sitting in class today, you know, and it just came to me. Should I start a cooking channel? Because I really like to cook, and people like my food. So, just in the comment box, just just tell me, should I make start a cooking channel called Brax Cooks? Just a thought. You know, but after you eat, like. If you go to a real Mexican restaurant and, and get like quesadillas, you know what you do with these? You wouldn't even feed these to your dang dog. <laughs> I just speak the truth, man. It's what God told me to say. <laughs> I mean, okay, but like I said, my dog would be too good to eat these. No, I'm just playing. Can you feed your dog this? I don't know. I know you can't feed a dog chocolate. You'll kill it. Don't ever feed a dog chocolate, man. Vegetables and meats only. Keep that dog living healthy. Alright. That's what I ate today. Power bowl and a freaking uh, quesadillas in this. Dude, that soda is just totally throw. Maybe it's this Mountain Dew in here. It's totally throwing me for a loop. Because it's like. It's like kind of sour. 
But it's good because it's refreshing. Like a slush. <laughs> okay, remember? This was the Taco Bell Blue Raspberry Airhead Freeze. Alright, my friends. Hope y'all like this. Go eat the Power Bowl. I don't know if y'all want to waste your money on this, but hmm, if you want, go ahead. You might like it. Alright. See y'all, whatever. Peace out, my friends!